what's up gamers today i am going to review three different recording and live streaming software which i have used personally and the first one is the obs studio as you can see right here in the record streaming section my settings and my presets and the recording section so let's begin this video so the first and the most popular live streaming and recording software is the OBS studio I have personally used it uh, for like uh, two months for streaming and uh, before that I used streamlabs and uh, after that I'm going to talk about the streamlabs so here's the clip and recording from the OBS studio and you can see there like frame skipping and like freezing screen much more in streamlabs and little will less in obs studio but the third software amd real life is the best software why why is it so so let's talk in this video about that so like here i recorded this gameplay on obs studio for about two minutes and on the left side left of corner you can see the average fps which is giving and uh, max x fps so you know you can ignore the max fps but the average fps so it's like uh, still better than the stream apps. and the uh, OG studio is no i'm not saying that it's uh, not the best but it is not that good for ryzen r3 2000 c processor with 8 gb ram and a single camera not so good and not so good high performance wise also it lacks more so i have like problems in playing games in obs studio um, so i'm not going to suggest that but uh, you can it's on you what you choose so the second software which i'm using is streamlabs obs as you can see my set settings over there my recording set settings my fps for recording and uh, so let's see the gameplay so you as you can notice there is like way much lag way more lag than obs studio i should say you can i i can barely play with it and it's not it's not perfect it's not worth it really not, not worth it so in this comparison video streamlabs is the most and the worst software for my myself for Ryzen i3, Ryzen R3 2000G processor for my set. No, I'm not talking about the other for the my set. It's not good and I'm not going to use it. But ha, if, yes, the advantage of Streamlabs is the more professional streams and if you have good PC and graphics card, then you should use Streamlabs OBS. Otherwise, if you have integrated GPU, so I will not recommend you to use it. It's more way more laggy than OBS Studio and the AMD Relay. So, and the third of software, right, which is right over here, AMD Relay. As you can see the settings over here, 720p resolution, and like all software, I used the all, more, almost, the more, almost the matching settings. And this here, as you can see, the bitrate is 20,000. Logi Studio and the Logi are around 5,000. So, like, much more change in it as you can see my fps is not dropping stable not that stable but still stable and no freeze gameplay no skipping frames nothing and i should say my personal experience that this is the best software you should stream on amd ryzen r3 processor because it's the it is an application which uh, provides by the AMD um, like NVIDIA depots but uh, it's way more different and uh, you I barely I barely see and feel Here. much less lag it's not the more not like other stream labs is the worst but OBS studio is a competitor not the others but stream labs OBS is the worst and OBS studio can compete with this here. so i'll end over here in here. my opinion the best software you should use is amd real life for information you can type on google on youtube how to download amd real life 
um, it thousands of video on the YouTube so I am not going to provide the video but if I'll just drop the link in the description for your youtuber for yours like benefit thank you thank you and we'll see you next week om zim am zim am bing bing bo tan tan sasten se tar chhat gayi chhati se om zim am zim am bing bing